It's much more interesting to embrace who you really are rather than waste energy pretending to be someone else. A lot of times people will think, I'm strong, I'm in shape, why can't I do this pose? But that's not the point. There's nothing to win in yoga. You just do what you can do, one day to the next. I'd rather be loud and misunderstood than quiet and bored, let's face it. I only practice yoga because the classes are always packed with beautiful women. Roads taken far away from you are many. Do not fear, mother, they all lead back. I'm confident. Some people don't like confidence. They resent confidence. I have a high self-opinion, I don't need to hide that. I don't need to be self-deprecating. I do believe that I deserve what I have. I don't think I'm entitled to it. That's a big difference. I'm intelligent enough to survive happily and be compassionate. If I were too smart, I would realize all the ills of the world. It is dangerous to exist in the world. To exist is to be threatened. We must live with threats. The power and the potency of music will transcend any one person's opinion about it. Taylor Swift is super charming. Damn you Swift. There are two kinds of men. There are men who are f***ing misogynist pigs, and then there are men who really love women, who think they're the most amazing people in the world. And that's me. Maybe the reason I was promiscuous and wanted to sleep with a lot of them, is that I love them so much. I'm fiercely independent, but I'm also terrified of being alone. I love music videos, I really do. I think it's kind of sad that it's a dying art form. I spend most of my life naked. In fact, I often have to be told by the people around me that it's inappropriate to be as naked as I am. In real life, I am emotionally confused, which enables me to write songs. I'm a Pisces, and they say that Pisces are very sensitive. If men were just honest with themselves, they would see that they all have that side. Not every song has to be about love and tenderness. Sometimes you have those strictly physical feelings for somebody, and it's okay to have those feelings. Yoga carves you into a different person, and that is satisfying physically. If world peace was as important to people as getting tweeted back by their favorite celebrity, we'd live in a blissful utopia. There's nothing to win in yoga. You just do what you can do, one day to the next. I can single-handedly dispel any ideas that sexuality is acquired. Trust me, you were born with it. My brother is gay, and we knew when he was too. People always, when you rise, whenever you're getting to a point where you're a very big band, which is a very rare thing, there are always going to be people that aren't going to like you. Agni may be good at destroying self-confidence, but Proactive Plus is good at destroying Agni. I was the music dude that was naked all the time with the girls, and that's fine, no problem with that. I'm cocky. It's different. Cocky is playful. Normal is enormously susceptible to swinging with the gusts of politics and history. Disguised as scientific and fixed, it is subjective and protean. That is why I use the word normative above, a term derived from statistics, simply meaning what most people do. I think pain is the best feeling for songwriting. You can write good happy songs, but I think the kind of brooding, depressing ones are more effective. They are easier to write when I am impassioned and angry. It is a good way to channel that negative energy. Before I go on stage, I pretend that everyone loves me. ADHD isn't a bad thing, and you shouldn't feel different from those without ADHD. At any Maroon 5 concert, you'll see a room backstage marked yoga. Markets are conversations. I don't think any relationship responds well to pressure. I felt like people only knew me as a singer who dated pretty girls. I had to fight with myself because he's so good, yet he's so popular. Nothing wrong with making money. When you commit to being a musician, I don't think you're really sure or care about when you're going to pay the bills. I don't think you care about that as much as you care about playing music. I think the first thing that you need to detach yourself from is numbers, because music has now splintered off into so many different forms of media. MTV doesn't play videos, the radio is now competing with the internet. Nobody has it all, but for me to even come close is amazing. I don't date my girlfriend because she's a model. I date her because I love her. 
Men are not as sophisticated as women. They're not as mature as women. They're not as connected with their emotions as women. There's a very Neanderthal quality that still exists in a lot of men. And if you're in the public eye, to me, it's very boring to say what you have to say and be media trained to the extent that you don't ever reveal any truth. There was a time in my life when I lived probably a bit more on the primal level. And it was amazing. I'm doing pretty well. If you don't get married, you can't get divorced. Why couldn't we learn from the devastatingly low percentage of successful marriages that our last generation went through? I want a steady marriage. I want to learn about it. I want to know it. I want to figure out whether or not I want to do it. I'm not just going to leap into it, because that's not good for anybody. Yoga takes what you have and molds and sculpts it, which is a much more natural way to look and feel. I absolutely loathe the idea of doing a fragrance simply as a moneymaker. Personal brand to make money? Vomit. You wouldn't be a complete band without a slightly cocky frontman, would you? Every male secretly wants sex with Brad Pitt. That's not true. I did not have sexual intercourse with Lindsay Lohan. A lot of people probably did, I don't know. I play in a band, I write songs, I sing, you know, perform on stage. Take control over your skin by using an acne treatment system that actually works, Proactive Plus. I've got the moves like Jagger. I have a very young brother and sister, and if you can get a kid singing the words to a song after they heard it for the first time, it's a hit. Shakira is a new friend, but I love her dearly already. She's so sweet and adorable and hilarious.